Welcome back everyone. This is my preferred echelon class. Uh, we'll start with the details first. Uh, class technique is sonar vision. Which uh, allows you to see enemies behind cover and hit up in the shadows and things. It's also supposed to disturb drones but I've never tried using it for that. I'm not sure how well it works. Uh, class item is the shock pistol, which is like a small EMP on um, things like drones. Can also kill soldiers as well. Uh, you get an extra 20% stealth in shadows. Uh, you get an extra 10% weapon damage, and suppressors on handguns don't have any reduced damage effect. Uh, while in stealth, you can auto aim your handgun at 150 meters or less. Uh, if someone starts trying to spot you, you can just snap your aim straight to the head and take them out, which is handy. Other times, that can be a pain in the ass, though. Uh, for weaponry, we're taking the ACR, which is our main weapon we'll use for clearing out bases. Got the short barrel. Extended mag, the suppressor, ATPL3, rail, uh, folding iron sight, STK enhanced stock, auto single trigger, and the underbarrel grenade launcher. I uh, use the grenade launcher mainly for just taking out enemy vehicles because that's the easiest way of doing that, getting rid of them fast. <coughs> Uh, next we've got the TAC-50 Snipe Rifle for taking out enemies at long range Also my go-to for taking out enemy helicopters and drones uh, I'll usually take the suppressor off when I'm taking out helicopters or drones though just because this um, gives you the extra 20% damage increase again that you lose for having a suppressor on uh, I've got the extended mag, the suppressor, T5XI sight and the bipod Pistol wise, got the 5.7 USG, extended mag, suppressor, and the ATPAL3 rail. Uh, I do use this more with the Echelon because of the auto target thingy. Uh, so I do use this sometimes when I'm sneaking in that bases, especially when it's dark and you can hide in the shadows to make use of the extra stealth. <coughs> Next we'll talk about perks, we've got Sixth Sense uh, If we are going to be sneaking around bases and that, obviously having the extra automatic mark and when you're getting closer to an enemy is always handy to have something like this uh, Next we have Rolling Thunder for the Snipe Rifle which increases weapon damage and damage to drones just to make it easier for taking out the drones, I usually use my Snipe Rifle on and then we've also got the ballistic advantage. Helps out a snipe rifle a lot, but also includes helping out the pistol and the assault rifle as well. Uh, then we've got the equipment wheel. Uh, we've got the shock pistol, which is locked in, which um, can be used to shut down machines. You can also kill human targets with it as well, it has like a blast area of effect. Uh, we've got C4, mainly for using on missions where we've got to blow something up, such as crates, parked vehicles, or computers or something similar. Uh, we've got sync shot drone. Uh, if we are trying to be stealthy and take out a base without getting detected, we can obviously use this to take out an enemy who finds a body before we can alert everyone else or if we do get detected we can also use it to take out the radio man before he can call for backup uh, if we're going to be doing a sneak in we might be glad of the breach torch so we can cut through the fences and get inside a base without having to go through the main way which is usually guarded uh, got bandages and bullet throw which are locked in uh, 
Mark II frag grenades, just in case things do go to shit. We can use frags if we need to take out a big group of them. Uh, we have the Mark I syringe as well, just in case we do take some damage, we can heal quickly. And then we have the rocket launcher for taking out enemy trucks. Um, also take usually hit a behemoth before I start firing at it with a launcher as well, just to check off a lot of us heavy armor so I can get to the weak points easier. Uh, I think that's about it for the Itchalon, I think. So thanks for watching everyone, and I'll catch you all on the next one.